A scholar, noteworthy historian, former administrator of the courts, political strategist, preserver of Guam's culture, and Guam native son. Just a few of the many descriptions of Tony Sanchez, who passed away last week. But those who knew Tony knew him best as a loyal friend and confidant, with a great sense of humor. Lifelong friend and fellow Father Duenas class of 76 graduate, Martin Gerber. Anyone who had the good fortune of spending time with Tony can attest to the wit and good humor which he embodied. Those who knew him said Tony's smile could light up a room. His laugh was infectious. He was committed to continuing the legacy of his father, Pedro Doc Sanchez, in preserving the island's culture and history, whether it was getting in the music studio to promote Guam's history and song, or creating films like The Given Tree. Tony was gifted, talented, and never afraid to follow his dreams. He was Guam's native son. He shared his dreams and desire to promote Guam's culture with his five children, who knew their dad as a man of many talents and whose gifts touched each of their lives in very unique ways. His son Jacob fondly recalls growing up with his siblings. As children growing up, he wanted us to know and love Guam as he did. He took us on camping excursions to Nomia, off-roading in Charlie Cologne, jet skiing at Family Beach, and on Uncle Dean's boat rides around the island. Dad was an adventurer, and we were his trusted we believe then, and still believe, that Guam is a magical place. Even as he battled his illness, Tony strived to do more for the community. He had goals of running for senator to better the island. But it was evident by the hundreds who attended his funeral today that Tony had already done that, touching so many people from all different walks of life. That our friend, Curry, brother, father and son, is not gone completely. He will never be forgotten. We will miss his quick wit, we will miss his wisdom, and most of all, we will miss his kind presence.